So I've been reading and watching the news recently on the smog. Uh, smoke and fog and bacteria, whatever else in the air. Uh, you got it over India and China, real densely populated areas. Poland, where they burned a bunch of coal. And we saw there's been a lot of major fires, a lot of deforestation. The forests are like our air filters, so less forest we got, less air filters we got. And with, you know, the more pollutant, the more coal, oil, and gas being burned than ever before, it is putting a stress on the planet, uh, you know, clean air. And uh, so what can be done? What are some solutions? Well, obviously planting trees, but scaling back the consumption of fossil fuels. Uh, you know, docking the cruise ships. Uh, you know, can we afford to allow recreational pollution on that scale? Uh, you know, banning recreational flying, flying for vacations. It uh, until we get electric planes, it uh, and you know more renewable energy. We don't really have energy to waste. We don't have air to waste for the pollution. And uh, schools. So schools create a lot of traffic, and I think. Uh, Moving the schools online is just the right thing to do. Uh, maybe kids go to school once or twice a week, but not every day. You know, it, uh, it'll reduce a lot of the traffic and a lot of the oil consumption. Uh, just uh, more people driving less. You know, go to the stores once a week. Just make a point of combining your errands and using less fuel and energy. I, you know, I look at the uh, the weather and I you know, do my laundry hanging out when it's dry or sunny or windy and uh, you know, I just make a point of using less energy and uh, you know multiplying the clean air plants uh, you know, getting those out to the people in the cities that's that's important you know sleeping with the snake plants by your beds an extra source of clean air uh, you know drinking the probiotic drink and eating the, the healthy natural organic produce and it's really the best uh, you know, best way to move forward. Just, you know, stay happy and healthy. And uh, there's a quote goes something like, you know, in times of great stress, and uh, it's always important to go back to, you know, am I eating right? Am I drinking right? Am I breathing right? Am I getting some physical and mental exercise each day? And am I getting you know right amount of rest? And uh, all that's important. And uh, Ah, uh, brother saying there's always challenges in the world. There's always problems, you know, a thousand years ago, there'll be problems a thousand years from now. It's all it's all relative. And uh so humanity we always face our problems and uh and improve the situation. But uh certainly it's come to a head, you know, too many automobiles, too many planes, trains, etc. and uh you know, we see it's just a uh, perpetual smog over uh, over the major cities and we don't want that to turn into a, to a giant health disaster, and uh, it's not the way to go forward. So, whatever can be done to, uh, to, 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 to reduce the emissions and uh, bring in the, uh, the air purifying plants.